Hey everybody, it's me, Rick Acosta, the Dodger Card Collector, coming to you with another video. Today I'm going to do something I don't normally do. Uh, I'm going to do a video response for Rick, Vintage Oddball Cards. Um, like I say, I normally don't do these, but I thought this one was fun uh, to, to give it a try. And uh, I'm also a big fan of Rick's because he has an incredible card collection. Whenever he shows off his cards, I just sit there and go, that's something I'm never going to own because he has he has a lot of great cards from the 20s and the 30s from all eras. And it's just fascinating to watch. One of the things I always think about when I think of Rick, uh, Rick and I are, are, in a, are in a group text. And every so often he'll flash some cards and I just sit there and shake my head and just go, that's amazing. But uh, when I was watching his video for this, uh, announcing this video response, I go, I always say to myself, Rick and I would never get along at a sporting event because he is totally a San Francisco guy. I am totally an L.A. guy and I could just see us going at it. But uh, that's the beauty, I think, of collecting baseball cards because we do have that in common. And he seems like a really good guy. So I do hope I get to meet him sometime, uh, maybe at a Burbank card show, Rick. I keep bugging you about it, but we'll see. So Rick is has passed 2,000 subscribers. Congratulations. And his uh, video response, this contest, is to try and stump John Mangini, who, in my opinion, probably has a card from every set. But I am going to try and throw him three pitches and see if I can get him to swing and miss on one of these. So... We have to find a card that, not a card, but a card from a set that John Mangini doesn't own. So let's turn the table or let's turn the camera around and we'll get going. All right, so my first pitch is going to be from the 1960 Morel Meats cards. These are, uh, I'm sure John's familiar, familiar with it. These were released in 1959, 1960, and 1961 by the Morel Meats Cards Company. And they are only feature Los Angeles Dodgers on here. So on here we have Duke Snyder. He's trying to play a fast one on us by batting right-handed. Gil Hodges, Duke Snyder. All with the L.A. Coliseum in the background. So there's my first pitch, John. Did I hit? Did you get a hit? Second pitch to John Mangini is the 1980 Los Angeles Dodgers police cards. Uh, these are sets that started in 1980, ran throughout the 80s, and I want to say the 90s. I could be wrong there, but this is the this is the only so-called vintage set because it's from 1980. So that's the only one I own. And featured here are the famous Dodger infill from the 1970s: Steve Garvey, Davey Lopes, Bill Russell, and Ron Say. And then in the back, it'll give you a tip from the Dodgers and. In this case, it's discussing a, what the double what a double play is. So this this set is the 1980 Los Angeles Dodger Police set. All right, I'm going to totally throw you an off speed pitch here for my third pitch, and just hope and pray that you have not yet bought the 1975 or excuse me the 2024 Topps Heritage set that features the 1975 Topps cards or design. So in this case, I'm featuring three Dodgers as I only collect uh, the Dodger team cards uh, for modern cards. And in this case, I have Freddie Freeman, Shohei Otani, and Mookie Betts. And those are from the 2024 Topps Heritage featuring the 1975 design. So that's my pitch to you, John. Do you have any of these? Do you have any cards from these sets? I'm going to say you do, but I'm going to take a chance. Thanks a lot, guys. We'll catch you next time.